Hi, Intuitive D1111 here, Deanna here. Thank you guys so much for being a part of our Diamond Star C family, y'all. I love reading you guys' comments. Okay, thank you guys for liking the video on the way in, as well as subscribing, hitting the notification bell. I'm going to be choosing a winner for a mini read this weekend. Let's get into it, because y'all fan club is cutting up here, okay? There's multiple energies that I'm seeing, but definitely most definitely there is somebody that is like they do not want to let go of your energy okay it says i'm not letting you go this is somebody that finds you to be very encouraging this is someone um that feels mo very motivated by you very inspired by you there's also a lot of attraction here as well um so i'm picking up on a lot of sacral chakra energy with this person there's something about um I don't know if your energy helps to level out their solar plexus chakra, which is very interesting. I've never really gotten that one before. Um, but yeah, there's something about this person feeling more confident um, in pursuing their goals when they're around you. And they don't necessarily feel that way with whatever other energies that, you know, they've been around. OK, they've been feeling more depleted here. This is somebody that's been thinking about the life that they could have built with you. Or maybe you're already dealing with somebody and they're thinking about, um, you know, how they can be more supportive within a home setting or growing your relationship here. Uh, but you definitely have someone where it says you invade my thoughts and I try to keep busy to keep my mind off of you, but I can't. So someone's consecutively thinking about you while they're working. OK, um, but this is someone here that is working through their insecurities for it could. I don't know. It could be for many different reasons, but it says I don't deserve you. So someone feels like they don't deserve um it's like they don't they feel like they don't deserve your love or your attention but they still want it <laughs> okay yeah this is someone that had a choice in the past and now they're realizing with i choose you that you were the person that they really should have you know um invested in or stayed with or um yeah i don't know i feel like a lot of y'all are at the point where it says i'm over it not dealing with bs taking back control so it's like the minute that you decided you were going to do that you know now somebody is realizing their feelings for you okay so we have i love you here um yeah so six of wands high priestess ace of cups king of swords that's a serious lineup here <laughs> okay um I feel like you guys are actively uh, pursuing your endeavors here. Okay, this is definitely celebrity diamond star seed energy, okay? Um, a lot of different people meet you. You're very unique, okay? They've never really encountered anybody like you. Um, for some of you, um, there is definitely the energy of people feeling better around you, okay? P people feeling more... Um, not just inspired, but also at peace at the same time. So you have a very calming energy around you, but at the same time, you get people excited, okay, in different ways. And with the high priestess here, the high priest or the high priestess, I feel like you guys are very intuitive. You're also very intuitive when it comes to um, which, which job that you should pursue, right? Which creative endeavor you should... Um, you know you should you should do or how you become more innovative here it's like somebody is definitely watching you somebody could be silent as well here with the high priestess and the ace of cups a lot of you guys um you have been loving yourself but you do have new love here or you have somebody that has secretly fallen in love with you okay this is someone that also could be in the limelight here or this is somebody here um, that could, for some of you, they could even feel threatened by the amount of attention that you get here. For some of, for some of you, you know, both of you guys, for some of you, both of you guys are meant to be famous in different capacities here. Okay. So that's an interesting one. Yeah. It's like both of you guys are very successful. Both of you are very looked up to as well. Yeah, somebody here is very intelligent here. Somebody wants to speak their truth, okay? With the King of Swords, the Ace of Cups, this is somebody that could have had a cold or hard exterior here, okay? It, it's definitely giving, um, you know, somebody really being strategic about hiding their feelings. I don't know why someone felt like they had to do the most. Yeah, but now somebody feels like y'all cold as ice, 
<laughs> okay we have breakup distance separation yeah somebody feels like the other person's giving them the cold shoulder here yeah like i said somebody's been hiding their feelings here but then we have love on the brain dreaming fantasizing daydreaming nostalgic so this person's been thinking about you a lot this person's thinking about how they treated you okay um this person could have been abrupt here okay or they could have even said something that hurt your feelings or maybe someone here is just consecutively um saying or doing things um and for some of you, they apologize, but for some of you, you were dealing with somebody that was very cold, okay? They were very arrogant. Um, if they did apologize, it was an empty um, apology, and they still just kept on doing their thing. Or for some of you, this person was just so arrogant, or they could have even been like, you know, a covert narcissist, right? They didn't even really want to own up to their mistakes, okay? They would just gaslight and redirect it back to you, okay? Okay. But somebody is realizing that the way that they have treated you or the way they've been pursuing different love connections in their life, period, it's like, no, something's backfiring here, okay? They're not getting the reaction out of you that they want. <laughs> For a lot of you, it's as simple as you're not even giving them your attention anymore. They're worried that you have new love here. Yeah, we have spades here, okay? It says, death and destruction bringers that come in and lie about their true intentions, they thrive off of illusions and fooling their victims here. So for some of you, this person definitely had some type of negative entity attachment and they didn't even know it. Some of you, they know it, right? Because they could very well be involved in something dark. But for a lot of you, it's like this person had something attached to them where whenever they were around your energy, they were... <sighs> It's, it's like they were around your energy, but they but they were treating you as an enemy when you were treating them nothing was showing them love. OK, that's what I'm getting here. OK, and then we have crime. I don't know why the hell this came out. OK, so maybe they have somebody maybe somebody around them. OK, or hopefully not them. OK, but we have says committed committing unwarranted acts of violence in the physical and spiritual realm towards others using extreme measures to fulfill an agenda here someone could even be a part of a corrupt group a corrupt organization okay i don't know it's kind of giving uh like corrupt business it's giving uh i don't know i don't know it's kind of i don't want to say gang vibes but it, it, it's it, it's like a mix of uh different types of crimes here that somebody y'all somebody really didn't got themselves in over their head yeah with dodging bullets blocking negativity escaping crazy people protected by haters here for some of y'all baby they done pissed off the wrong people or they owe a lot of different people money okay somebody here yeah they were promising to y'all somebody was promising to just either to do different things here to receive money or promising that they were going to pay back money and now they owe people okay yeah i don't know it says looking for something for free and then giving money here for some of you guys it could be very as simple as they were hooking up um with somebody that they consecutively had to keep giving money to okay or maybe somebody here wants to come back and kiss your ass here because they're hoping that you are going to give to them okay while they've been out here giving to others like what is this energy here y'all got time yeah somebody sees you in this in, in this in this boss energy here okay emperor empress energy so someone could run the, run their own business they could be stable okay someone could be very busy or they're multi multifaceted or they work smarter not harder here somebody sees that you're very loved respected admired and idolized here okay <sighs> Yeah, I feel like either somebody here is trying to get money from someone or they feel like a fool for consecutively giving their money to Carmisha or Quan. <laughs> That's what I'm getting here. And Carmisha and Quan, if it's not your person involved in all this, it could be Carmisha or Quan that's involved in all this, okay? So they're, they're starting to realize that whatever type of attacks that they've done, because they, see, this person sees somebody as a money machine, right? So they feel like you're messing with their money if you take this person. So whatever type of... Um, negative attacks they were trying to send you all of that has backfired here because somebody is still you know carrying deep emotions for you even if they're hiding it here but this person here i don't know for some of y'all they feel like y'all the ice king or the ice queen okay but they also need to take responsibility for how they've contributed to you being that way right yeah six of cups here okay this is somebody <laughs> from your past right or this is a soul connection here for some of you kids could be involved here i feel like you guys are very balanced okay 
you have new be beginnings coming here. You have a lot of different people that are attracted to you, attracted to your energy here. But I feel like a lot of y'all just ain't interested <laughs> with the four of cups here. I don't know what it is here. Somebody feels like, or different people feel like it's hard to get your attention. Okay. Or for some of you, this could very, very well just be saying that somebody's not even attracted to their partner anymore. Okay. So if they're dealing with Carmesha or Kwan, the Ace of Wands, the Four of Cups, I mean, that's a sad one. You feel me? <laughs> That's a sad wand right there. I mean, it's not as bad as the Ace of Wands in reverse because that could be a wand that can't even stand, you feel me? But the Four of Cups is like, mm, it's, it's giving like, oh, you know, baby, let's do A, B, C, and D tonight. And oh, no, you know, I'd rather go think about the collective. <laughs> you know what I'm saying? Like, this is, man, yeah, I kid you not. It, it, has, a, it has a third party hot right now. Okay, they on fire because they feel like this person is not attracted to them. They're not loving them the same anymore. They feel like this person doesn't want to be with him here. There's a lot of different family issues that somebody could be going through. Okay, somebody could be using, you know, a lot of emotional manip man uh, manipulation like, you know, oh, you want to break up our situation or if we have kids, you want to mess, you know, you want to mess up, um, you know, their lives by our, us separating it. Like somebody is really just trying to do the damn most and the other person is just not interested anymore, okay? I feel like with content, for a while somebody thought that they could be satisfied with the current state even if it wasn't that good, but now somebody's doubting that, okay? See, somebody is doubting who they gave their love, time, and attention to, okay? This is somebody now that's thinking about how they can come and chase after you here, Okay, because they see you vibrating high. Okay, they see you focus on, you know, on your own healing or focus on helping others, the community, the collective, right? Focusing on your crafts here. Okay, Gemini, Libra, Aquarian energy. Somebody wants to communicate about some type of contract here. Okay. And there could very well be somebody around them that knows something that was done in an unconventional way here. Damn. I don't know why I heard a lot of people are getting bad karma, man. There's a lot of people. Some of you guys is a whole damn group, okay, of people that just went against you for no damn reason or whatever their reason was that still didn't give them the authority to do what they were trying to do here. Because we have shine that says your light irritated their demons, okay? We have detective. You've been using your gift of discernment and other gifts to solve anything that's unclear or a mystery to you. You've been tapping in and receiving downloads here, and this has somebody irritated, Okay, for some of you, it's Carmesha or Kwan, or it's somebody else um, that is somehow, you know, connected in your energy or trying to be in your energy here. Okay, it says karma transfer, the ability to transfer karmic outcomes from one person to another, deceiving others into taking on their karma. This is ridiculous. For some of you, it's, it's as simple as an ex going through a lot of bad karma for what they've been doing. And instead of them working through that karmic lesson on themselves, that's them trying to come back to you to have you take on their karma with them. And that's a no, because for a lot of you guys, this person, not only have they hurt you, but they've hurt many other people. So I heard they're taking that karma to the grave. If they they don't learn this lesson damn okay and there definitely was somebody in the mix okay they could have been sending out death wishes towards another person or using rage and anger to channel dark energies to silence another person low-level magic yeah somebody didn't want you speaking your truth here somebody didn't someone also didn't like the the way someone in particular felt loved or empowered around you because then whatever binding or negative energy work they were doing on that person no longer was working. Okay. Somebody wanted to keep somebody in a lower vibration here so that they could just, you know, use them like a puppet pretty much. Okay. All these different people are getting karma. It says negative karma, right? Because karma could be good or bad. It says those who have cast his spells or plotted against the innocent in any way will receive a flaming hot dose of their own medicine. Okay, burning. Okay, and for some of you guys, these people, baby, they've sold their souls in all types of different things to be in different organizations so they could receive fame or power or wealth. Okay, so for some of you, I mean, baby, it says it very clearly um, burning. Okay, fire, gnashing of teeth. Okay, is giving revelations energy here. Like, I didn't mean to get that deep with it, but somebody needs to know to stop playing in y'all's energy here. That's a no, okay? Because whatever they're doing here, I don't care if it's family members, if it was so-called friends, okay? If it was, 
you know, just random people uh, that were jealous that were watching you. Okay, they're paying a price right now. And a lot of you, it's just somebody that's so upset that, you know, you're full of life and they are um, discontent with everything that's around them, right? Good Lord. <laughs> or discontent with their choice that they made. Yeah, Eight of Cups, y'all walking away from any type of drama here. You don't have time for it. Okay, with the Knight of Swords here, it's like somebody wants to invite you back in, but I feel like it's, it's giving trickster energy here. Yeah, with the Six of Cups here. Okay, from the past. Now somebody's realizing everything they could have had with you here. There's some type of offer here, but with this offer comes some type of drama with a, um, with a karmic third party. Okay, arguments, physical fight at war, competing. Some of y'all, this person's had so many third parties that you might not even know who's sending you the negative energy, okay? Because somebody over here was Community D or Community Pum Pum, okay? That's for some of y'all, okay? But they're definitely dealing with an obsessive lover, okay? It says a dangerous, toxic, unhealthy, possessiveness, karmic. This karmic is extra triggered, okay? And that's facts here. They got a problem, <laughs> okay? Instead of looking at y'all, they need to look at themselves here. Okay, somebody is over overthinking about all the different things coming to light, okay, that they've been doing. Because for some of you, this karmic has been out there messing around or been doing shady stuff or illegal stuff. Yeah, it says coming to light, something hidden being found out, okay? They don't want this person, the entities attached to this person don't want whoever it is that has these deep emotions for you knowing that, that they're an empty vessel, okay? For some of you that they've sold their souls and hopefully it wasn't, you know, somebody's X that has joined in on that karmic path, right? Hopefully not. But this is what they're dealing with, okay? So someone who lacks a soul essence, this person is prone to demonic possession. The source of energy is from demonic forces. Yeah, okay? This person's a complete hot mess here because everything's backfiring on this person. This person's been working with moon cycles, all types of different things here, okay? They've tried, <laughs> yeah, they've tried all different types of avenues, y'all, okay? I'm not even going to get into it here. Now somebody is seeing this third party as a liar. They realize it was all about money here, okay? And see, this third party here wanted to, to attack your money because they don't want this person to see you as expansive here, okay? They don't want them seeing you in empress energy or emperor energy. Yeah, y'all are very unfazed here, okay? You guys have abundance coming in and your spiritual detectives, okay? So you see what's going on. You're seeing behind the veil here. Okay, with the Ace of Cups. For a lot of you, you know that new love is coming or you know somebody is in love with you or you know that somebody has had these feelings for you. Okay, this is somebody, in fact, that does want a commitment here. Someone definitely could be married up in the mix, though. Okay, I definitely see that here. <coughs> and we have the Ace of Pentacles. Some of you guys have um, a very committed partner where the connection is going to grow. Or you're going to meet them and it's going to grow and it's going to expand and be a long-term partnership within the next month or the next year, okay? Because cups are months, pinnacles are years. Yeah, y'all are ready for a whole new beginning here. I feel like somebody wants a new beginning. Somebody knows that someone wants to grow um, and expand with you. They know somebody wants to invest in you, okay? So for some of you guys, this is a new job, okay? There's new opportunities coming in towards you, Okay? And for a lot of you, this person has been trying to work on themselves, right? I'm picking up on different energies, okay? So there's different offers that could be coming towards them as well, too. Somebody just wants a new beginning here, okay? I feel like someone definitely is trying to figure it out here, okay? Maybe they had a choice, but for a lot of you here, I feel like this person feels like you have options. They feel like you have a choice. They feel like you're in love with somebody else, and they can't handle it, right? Yeah, we have over here, it says, I want you back here. But, you know, pregnancy could be in the mix here, okay? Yeah, somebody over here, they are definitely done with somebody. We have F your feelings here. They don't care how much somebody has been spying or keeping tabs on them. They feel like this person is a haunted, tortured soul for everything that they've been doing in the dark, I'm hearing. Yeah, somebody's crazy ex, okay, that's been stalking you or them or both of you and doesn't want you with anybody else here it's like this person was definitely doing some type of dark magic here this person could have even been with online bullying harassment uploading embarrassing photos like this person could have been threatening this person that they were going to do something like that to them or this is someone that could have literally been trying to cyber bully um you know bully you guys in different ways online whatever the the problem is is somebody is intimidated here 
Okay, it says being placed under the spotlight to draw people in to receive words of guidance, healing and wisdom, liberating others with knowledge here. So, yeah, this is you guys in this star energy here. Okay, they could have had their friends. Okay, other people that they've been connected with <sighs> watching you guys as well. Yeah, we have the full card and the seven of cups. I feel like you guys are going to have so many different opportunities coming towards you. You're going to have to choose what it is you want. For some of you guys, it's a lot of different love opportunities that are coming in. Okay, yeah, the seven of cups, six of pentacles. It's a lot of different people that want to date you here. The four of wands, the queen of pentacles, because people are seeing um, that, you know, you are husband or wife material. Okay, you are somebody that they would want to have, um, you know, be with for the long term here. Okay, so I definitely feel like if that's something that you're wanting, you're definitely manifesting that in. Now, I do see also there could be a lot of drama within a home or within a marriage contract because there is somebody here that's constantly wondering, OK, well, damn, where is all the money going? <laughs> Where the money going? Somebody want to know with the seven of cups and six of pentacles. It's like, listen, we had to pay A, B, C, D, but I noticed you have E, F, G out your, you know, out, out your bank account. Like, who are you spending money on? Bam, who you giving money to? The sneaky link, right? Yeah, somebody, y'all, somebody sneaky link could have betrayed them here. Maybe they were meeting up with them in a the motel or maybe they were just meeting up with them in secret, right? Yeah. Okay, I feel like somebody could come forward with some BS because they're mad that somebody ghosted or abandoned them. Okay, now has somebody stressed and pressed here? They're miserable thinking about um, <laughs> how they connected with this third party. Okay, I don't know, Karmisha and Kiki, because it's given like maybe even multiple Karmics up in here. Okay, somebody could be in jail, on their way to jail here. Okay. Karmisha or Kwan could be on their way to jail here. Whatever spell work they were doing, it backfired, okay? Because someone definitely went to a practitioner or was one, and they are so upset about it. They are vexed, okay? They are fed up that whatever they're doing is not working. I kid you not, Karmisha. I thought they were keeping secret something that you or your person didn't know, okay? For a lot of you, that they was out there hooking up with somebody else. <laughs> wow. Okay. Yeah, so now somebody here is like baby they've been they've been thinking about you throughout work okay this person could smoke or drink here for the six of swords the eight of pentacles this could be even somebody that maybe they they tr they like to travel or they travel for work or they drive for work here okay somebody here wants reconciliation as well okay somebody wants to work towards moving or moving themselves into karma water here it's like someone's trying to move away from the drama here there's a lot of drama because it's like people keep stalking and watching you don't they have something else better to do <laughs> yeah constant thoughts of you somebody wants to reach out to you okay for some of you they might reach out while they're intoxicated here we have over here it says i plan to make a move on you soon i can't resist you anymore okay and this is someone that sees you as standing in your power Okay, but they're worried that you're uninterested. Some of you guys, you are. This person's in despair here. Okay, yeah, with the chariot here, you guys have victory and success here. You're moving forward. There's some type of wish fulfillment that's coming in for you guys. We have the nine of cups here and the hierophant here. So for some of you guys, within the next nine months, you could be within a whole new situation, like a whole new relationship here. For others of you... Damn, we have over here, we have ex-lover, I want you back. I realize you're the only one for me. Letting go and door close, yeah. Okay, quite a few of you guys are done with an ex-lover here, okay? Or they're letting you know that they're done with Karmisha or Kwan here. There's some type of understanding that's going to happen after some type of phone call or message here. Someone is realizing how obsessed somebody is with you and the fact that you have this single energy, be it female or man, or <laughs> that is um, either pursuing you or connected to you, okay? Or about to come in for you, okay? This is a boss that will take care of you and only wants one woman or man and is attracted to you, okay? So that's what you're attracting in. Somebody that's going to be faithful, that's loyal, okay? This is somebody that's marriage material, okay? They will hate nothing about you, okay? And it's going to have a lot of different people, especially your exes, mad as hell, okay? Or they already are if you have that energy in your life, right? Because it says getting caught, secrets revealed, exposed, guilty confession here. It's like whoever they've been dealing with, it's already been exposed how, you know, sprung on you they are, okay? It says fantasizing about you but can't have you here. Yeah. 
So you have people that are going to be coming towards you. It says, mark my words, promises, meaning what I say, won't let you down. So somebody wants to stand on business now. Somebody wants to apologize. They want the will to turn in their favor here. They want to speak their truth with the Ace of Swords here. Okay, for some of you guys, if this person's not fully out of a contract or fully out of a marriage, they could want a secret rendezvous. Lord help us. <laughs> okay, somebody been keep, this person's been keeping tabs on you. Yeah, somebody try to hook up with y'all. That's what I'm seeing here. Okay, then we have confession over here. Here. somebody wants to let you know damn they try to stay <laughs> they try to stay the night with y'all okay this is somebody that's missing you here they feel like you moving in silence i would continue to con i would advise you to continue doing that okay they just feel like you're hard to get next to or you're very hard to read because you're so unbothered they're not used to that Okay, they feel like time is running out here because they feel like you've met somebody else or you're about to meet somebody else, right? Uh, and they can't handle it with anxiety, scared, panic here. Okay, then, we, and then they're thinking about, it says, I wish I could take back the last thing I said to you or what they've done to you in the past here. Somebody has a lot of regret. They're ashamed and they're embarrassed. Um, because with the six of pentacles, it's like, you don't want to be, you're not going to be breadcrumbed anymore. You're not dealing with that mess. You're wanting an equal give and take within a connection here. And you are calling in somebody that is going to give to you, right? And reciprocate. So damn, put some hearts down below, some champagne glasses, y'all put some money bags, some rings. Cause there's a lot of different things that I see that you all, you all are uh, manifesting in. Thank you for spending time with me. Love you guys. Namaste.